ask my Twitter followers who are streamers to show me their merch. And you guys super delivered. And I really have to say, I did not expect this much amazing merch from everybody. You gotta understand, I come from a time of streaming when merch was really not a big focus. Or at least it kind of, it kind of was a big focus, but there was a lot of really bad streamer merch out there. I remember literally being one of the first streamers ever on the Twitch platform to have super high quality shirts for sale from my brand. And it's true, I even got permission from Michelle Fire and Bob Camp so that I could use the likeness of Powdered Toast Man on my merch. I'm also basically the only streamer on the platform to use Glow in the Dark for their shirts as well. I still don't know why you streamers don't try to get Glow in the Dark shirts. It's literally the coolest thing you could put on a shirt. It's literally the coolest. Anyway, that being said, times have changed. Your guys' merch is incredible. You guys put a lot of work into it, and I am excited extremely impressed. I used to not be so impressed by streamer merch, but right now, I am really impressed. So right now, rather than reacting to all of your merch, I am just going to showcase my favorite merch that I saw from streamers on Twitter. So here we go, let's get into it. This video is sponsored by G Fuel, my favorites, where you can save a bunch of money by using my code DUTY uh, when you purchase when you purchase stuff. I've really been liking the Mighty Poo, the Conquer's Bad Fur Day one. It's it's fucking amazing. Thanks for the sponsor, G Fuel. I love you so much. Okay, without further ado, let's look at your merch, guys. I am actually very very excited. Let's do this. So here's the OG tweet. My wonderful Elmira shirt. My friends uh, designed this. My my friends designed the sleeves, and then they redesigned her, and then the logo and everything. Ghoul vibrations and faint of art. Very very happy with this one. This one this one will be back for uh, for Halloween. I love this shirt. Okay, Arsiphone. Now I did look at this one. This one is so cool. Sailor shrimp. Sailor shrimp. This is amazing. I love the aesthetic. I always wanted kind of like a shirt in the style with the Japanese characters and this little aesthetic design. And I love it because it makes no sense. It makes no sense to me because I don't get the joke, but it makes sense in general. Like it's just sailor shrimp. It's great. It's great. If I were to see this walking down the street and somebody were wearing this shirt, I would be like, whoa, this would be a head turner. This 100% would be a head turner. This is Queen Salem, and they said they went for a death metal style mer merch. Nothing too fancy, but something I know I would wear myself. Yes, exactly. I like this. Now, I'm a part of the meme. Like, I can't, I wouldn't be able to read this if I like, unless I give it a really good look, but that doesn't mean it's bad. All metal logos are like this, and I think that's amazing. Putting your brand out there with something a little bit more unique and original for streamer merch is amazing and this is this is dead on the nose any any person who's a fan of metal might see this merch and be like oh wow oh is that a band I have to check out and then maybe they can read it and then they get to this they get to this streamer and it's like oh wow this is a streamer okay I, I'm into this we're into the same thing that's one step and, and that's one step and let's see what they got for for their stream. And I really like this. I think this is awesome as hell. This is this is the kind of thing that I made uh, my original logo. And now this is a little less um, like death metally, but that was what I was going for. But that that was kind of like my first shirt ever. The logo's a little death metal. It's a care. It's a care bear blessing. Another care bear. I love this shirt. Um, but yeah, I, uh, I love that. I love that. Now, my buddy Awkward Scone here has this great, great Christmas, uh, design sweater. And I gotta be honest, this is, this is amazing. This is a really great Christmas design. The font reminds me of The Office because it's that typewriter. I don't think this has anything to do with The Office. I think this has more to do with the vine where she's just like, Christmas. Um, but I love it so much. This is really cute. The pink is a super nice touch. Not enough pink that you see on Christmas, I think, for Christmas shirts, and I like pink stuff. I think everybody should snag one of these, uh, for Christmas. Okay. My buddy, Madrea Star. These are incredible. These are so incredible. The art is really good. The use of color 
is 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 honestly even better. Whoever your artist is, you better you better uh, let me at them. But what I like most about these, and if you know me, you probably already know. But the fact that this whole thing goes first of all the AOP the all over and the fact that the design goes off the bottom lip which is so rare even the sleeves lip uh, is so rare you don't see a lot of streamers really take that freedom of doing the whole thing usually what I find about streamers is that they take the templates that Streamlabs gives them for merch and they only go by that and they don't learn anything. They don't they don't know that they can go so far outside the box and that this something like this is actually very far outside the box. Madrea, you are amazing, dude. I love Madrea's merch so much. I might cop one of these. Okay, well, I sure hope I can show this. This is <laughs> this is uh Jade Infinite, and I gotta be honest, this is the fucking this is, this is a great shirt. This is a great crew neck. I like the crew neck choice. Um, yeah, I like this. I would wear the fuck out of this shirt. I would wear the shit out of this. This is totally my style. I wear a lot of crew necks. I like the the box design sometimes. I was just talking about how I like all over print, but if but given the right image, I make a lot of parody merch. So as you can see, sometimes the box design it's really really it's it works really well but this is uh this is hilarious this is really really good i like this a lot uh this is this is like a nine out of ten i would i would cop this and i'm thinking about it this is so fucking funny all right now this is my buddy christical and i love this so much i really like merch that Oh, I could, I could, I could, I recognize the Canva font. Uh, I really like merch that has this metal, like metal, like horror, like that kind of stuff, counterculture style stuff. But I really like when it gets portrayed like this with happiness and sunshine and rainbows. Uh, this is my favorite kind of shit. This is basically my whole shtick, my whole, uh, my whole niche on, on streaming is, is this, is summed down into this. I hate this because I really want to buy the last like five shirts that I saw. So this YouTube video is going to become really bad for my wallet. So I'm just going to say that, uh, Christical, this is awesome as hell. I love, I love this design. It is so, it is so fucking cool. My boy, gah, I love this dude. This dude, I, I, uh, I know him from TikTok. And I, I, when I saw Emo Night, one of the first times they had these sticker packs and this is always a reminder that I need to get back on my sticker game and pogs and my little merch. I also want to make croc charms and I saw something at the fair I went to last night. I saw, uh, iPhone watch charms and stuff like that. So I want to kind of make those things. So I got to get back on this like Ga and Ga is such a goddamn talented artist. Like, look at this stuff. Anything that he wants to create can become merch it doesn't even matter his his niche and his style is so well defined that it doesn't matter as long as he makes it it can make really good merch he she should have he should have his own store at like the fairs that i go to and everything this is amazing okay meet mommy Let's see what let's see what we got we got some really nice art i like the green hearts aesthetic <laughs> Double fisting hot dogs tri blend shirt. Wow. This is amazing. This is really dope. This is really dope. I like this. I like this. I like this stuff. It's 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 not too general. It's obviously it goes in one direction. Like you know um you know which you know which general direction that the merch kind of theme overall is going in. I like the simple stuff really well because it still just says you. Very fucking cool. Hot dog. You love those hot Oh my god. This is amazing, dude. I love the hot dog shirts. They're so cool. I gotta give this a 7 out of 10. This is just a lot of really cool stuff. Very fucking cool. Love Jay Lee, another one of my TikTok friends. Dude, this is really good stuff too. Who the hell is your artist? Do you draw this your, yourself? Like this is so good. This is again, stuff that I would see at like a horror convention or something like that. This reminds me of the Haunted Mansion shirt that I just bought um, at a horror convention, at a mini horror convention. Uh, if I, if I had any, see, I love the, I love the Sailor Moon 
or the uh, I love that. That's that, that the crossover is so good. If I were to suggest, I would do something with Disneyland just because I love Disneyland so much. This is amazing, dude. Whoever the, whoever your artist is, or if it's you, is great, dude. Really good stuff. I like this a lot. Eight out of ten. Love Jay Lee. Fucking amazing. Mints. Pretty damn cool. Pretty damn cool stuff here.